Good morning. Good day, everybody. How are you all? This is Dr. Nandi. Subhash, Nandi kotha bolchi. Subhprabhat apna de shabai ke. Asha kodi apna ra bhalo achen. Salam alaikum. Namaskar. Ami aaj ke integral calculus se ekta problem solve kulo. So, let me share my computer screen with me, you. Let me see if I can move this down so that we can take a look at the problem. So it's find the indefinite integral integration of 1 over e to the power of 2x plus e to the power of minus 2x dx. e as you know is the natural number. Okay, so let's uh, solve this problem. Let's uh, change the color of our ink. Let's uh, make it a little bit interesting. Let's select this color. Okay. So, let's solve this problem. Solution. Let U is equal to e to the power of 2x okay so <clears throat> du in that case if i take the derivative on both sides i get du is equal to derivative of 2x is 2 e to the power of 2x dx okay now in the original problem integration of 1 over e to the power of 2x plus e to the power of minus 2x in the denominator dx divide the numerator and denominator and denominator by e to the power of minus 2x so you may ask me why am i dividing by e to the power of minus 2x that will help me to simplify the expression as you will see more to come please do not quit right away i'll give you some important tip at the end of this program um, so since i'm dividing the numerator and denominator by e to the power of minus 2x i get 1 divided by e to the power of minus 2x in the numerator and in the denominator there are two separate terms each of them gets divided by e to the power of minus 2x and of course do not forget the dx part so this is divided by e to the power of minus 2x now e to the power of minus 2x 1 divided by that means when I bring the e to the power of minus 2x in the numerator of the numerator, original numerator, it becomes e to the power of 2x divided by e2x divided by e to the power of minus 2x minus 2x comes to the numerator and becomes positive uh, e2x. So in the numerator of the first term, I have e2x times e2x plus e minus 2x divided by e minus 2x is 1 dx or in other words I have e to the power of 2x divided by 1 plus e to the power of 4x 2x plus 2x is 4x dx okay so how do i simplify this so let's uh, now start with e to the power of 2x in the numerator divided by 1 plus e to the power of 4x dx okay so i'm going to multiply the numerator and denominator 
by 2. So dividing by 2, that is multiplying by 2 in the numerator, integration of 2 e to the power of 2x, 1 plus e, 4x is nothing but, as you know, e 2x square dx. Okay. Now, I have already shown you the du in the top over here. If you go over here, du is equal to 2 e to the power of 2x dx. So, basically, I get half in the numerator 2 e to the power of 2x times dx is nothing but du and 1 plus e to the power of 2x is itself u. So 1 plus u square. Now, let me move the screen a little bit up, and create some space. So I have half integration of du divided by 1 plus u square. By formula, integration of now integration of du 1 plus u square, of course, I forgot the du part here. No, this is the du is there. Is 1 plus, this is 1 plus u square. And that is equal to uh, <coughs> arc tangent of u or tangent inverse of u. Hence, half du 1 plus u square is equal to half arc tangent of u plus c which is an integration constant where c is equal to integration constant. Okay, so now I will substitute the value of u. If you remember, u i u is equal to e to the power of 2x. Okay, so the final answer of integration of 1 e to the power of 2x plus e to the power of minus 2x dx is equal to half arc tangent and for u I'm going to write e to the power of 2x because that's the original substitution I did plus c where c is an integration constant. So that is your final answer. Uh, let me try to highlight that and see if I can, uh, yes I can highlight it using this. So that is your final answer. Half arc, arc tangent means tangent inverse e to the power of 2x plus c where c is an integration constant. So do not forget the c. So I stop here today but let me give you a brief uh, synopsis of what I did. So So we started with uh, substituting for e to the power of 2x is equal to u. We took the derivative of both sides. du is equal to 2 e to the power of 2x dx. Okay. So <clears throat> now in the original problem, we divided both the numerator and denominator by e to the power of minus 2x. So 1 over e to the power of minus 2x in the numerator in the denominator, each of the two terms get divided by e to the power of minus 2x, which simplifies to e to the power of 2x in the numerator divided by 1 plus e to the power of 4x. Now, we multiply the numerator and denominator by 2. That is, we divided the denominator or multiplied the denominator by 2, multiplied the num numerator also by 2 because 2 divided by 2 is 1. Why did I do that? Because uh, <clears throat> then uh, 
as I have derived here before, du is 2 to e to the power of 2x dx, I get du in the numerator. For 2 e to the power of 2x dx, I can write du comes from derivative of du, okay? So a half du for the entire term in the numerator divided by 1 plus and e to the power of 2x is u, so 1 plus u square. Why did I reduce to this form? I reduced it to this form because integration of du over 1 plus u square is equal to arc tangent of u. So that's a big simplification. And final answer is then half tangent, half arc tangent u plus c. And for u, I will substitute e to the power of 2x. c is the integration constant. Okay, the tip is you could have done this problem without substituting e to the power of 2x is equal to u. You could have divided the numerator and denominator by e to the power of minus 2x to start with and did the problem that way. But this is also easy to do by this method. So whichever method is easy for you, please follow that method. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. This is my genuine request to give me a thumbs up that motivates me to produce more interesting videos just for you. And please also like this video by giving me thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button. If you like this video, share with your friends. You and your friends, please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button. And please do not forget to click on the bell button which will notify you every time you upload a new video. I upload a new video, which I do almost every day. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a nice day. See you next time.